hello everyone welcome to a new video in this video we will learn how to add faq or frequently asked question in wordpress using a limited free plugin but before jump into the main tutorial please subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest wordpress tips and tricks and it inspired me make this type of helpful video for wordpress users and wordpress learners as well okay let's get started very first let's check which we are going to do in this tutorial this is my home page which I have added only for the tutorial purpose and if I scroll down then you can see this is the FAQ or frequently asked question which I have added with the limited free plugin. You can see very fast I have added a question mark then the text frequently asked question and this is a accordion actually if you click here on over the text then you can see open the another text box okay so in this tutorial we will learn how to add this type of FAQ section with elementor free plugin so already i have created a page whose name is faq so edit the page with elementor click on the plus icon to add a new section then the flex box okay and you can see in the left side content layout flex box and content width box i want to give it full width then the width will be pixel and i want to give like 1905 pixel okay then i want to give some padding like navigate to the advanced tab and this is the padding section actually i want to give like top will be 95 pixel and bottom will be 95 okay then the publish it then again click on this plus icon add element from the very top left side okay then the layout container just drag and drop here then again i want to give this container flex box and content width will be full width and i want to give this width like pixel and one two Eight zero pixel and it will be middle so again navigate to the advanced tab and select this center okay this is the container now very fast we have to add a icon so icon box just search here icon box or icon list you can see icon list just drag and drop here then the I have to keep only one item so I can close other two and click here then the check box i have to give here the question mark so click here and search here question you can see this is the question mark and i want to use it so if you want then you can use another icon so i want to use it so click over here question circle and from the right side bottom click on insert okay then the navigate to the style tab and the click on this icon section then size i want to give like 45 pixel okay and it will be center okay then the text okay typography and time to text will be like 45 pixel as well okay and it will be bold okay and then again i want to give this question mark and the text will be middle so again navigate to the style tab and alignment will be center okay then we have to add here toggle or accordion so again click on from the left side top plus icon add element and search here accordion you can see this is the accordion which we are going to use in this tutorial just drag and drop here okay then three item very first we have to fix it actually we want all item will be closed okay so interaction click on this section interaction then they can see default state it first 
expand selected but we want to all closed okay so all closed then the max item expand i want to on like one so if you want then you can use multiple okay then published from the right side top refresh the page okay you can see it works fine now we have to give text here so again go to our demo FAQ section then we can copy the text from here just copy it then paste here layout then the item one click here then you can see this is the plus icon we have to give the text here okay then search here text area this is the text area drag and drop here then the give text here okay so we can copy the text for my demos FAQ section and paste here okay so in in this way you can add more item so again go to the content tab select it and content tab if you want then you can add more item from here then the in the same way you can just give here our goal or target so, so in this common question you can add here and you can give answer as well so if you want then you can install it so again click on this pencil icon and navigate to the install tab then you can see a space between items just you can see this is if you want then you can increase the gap from here okay distance from the content actually i want to give like it will be five and it will be five as well within the header if you want then you can change color from here and like this is the text color then the icon size if you want then you can change the icon size increase or decrease decreasing uh, i hope 15 will be the perfect okay 15 is perfect so i want to keep like 15 then the content okay background if you want then you can set the background color from here then the padding border type if you want then you can change the border type from here then the accordion you can see this is the normal and background type if you want then you can change the background color okay actually i think white is the perfect as a background color so i want to keep it just a default okay so in this way you can add a fake section in your website thanks for watching the video please subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest wordpress tips and tricks